what's up you guys killing my cake for her back again pretty much we're going to do a little unboxing and review and this is my first um, view of this product and it's actually from MSI actually this is MSI NG60 GTX and actually the model number is uh, M2D 1GD5 um, graphic card this is uh, from SI um, I needed a new uh, GPU for NVIDIA so I decided to go with MSI for my blue theme and I found one very good and you can tell this is the 560 GTX this is the non TI version um, no one had done a video so I decided to uh, do a video about it um, this is a good, good. Um, I check the reviews on it. And it's a very good graphic card. Um, if you get two of these, you get to get some monster uh, scores on Vantage and uh, three, um, three Mark Eleven. And this, to show you a little bit, this, here's the actual. Do this in 1080p. Um, this is a little bit better than uh, the regular um, standard uh, 560 GeForce card. This has uh, solid capacitors, long, a longer life. Uh, copper moss MOSFET on the actual cooler is dual sided on top and you can run this in, on SLI two of them and you get some good scores guarantee you and I love one product of MSI they have the afterburner program you can overclock it 85 percent more and this is Windows 7 ready and yeah I'm gonna show you the front this actually has a see a three-year warranty if you um, register in 30 days so yeah and this is ready for uh, 3 mark 11 and wanted to tell you what actually I got with this deal I actually got a deal for the standard uh, standard uh, advanced of uh, 3d mark 11 uh, advanced edition it was worth 20 bucks and I got it for free with buying this card thank you very much for new Egg. and I got this it's right now on sale for 189.99 with this deal here and um, and if you buy it, it usually comes about two eleven. I live in California, so there's taxes included. If not, people will be like two hundred dollars, so it's pretty good. So let's just get this going and open it. It's gonna let me a little bit difficult, but yeah, I haven't. I'm very happy. So here it is. There's no uh, worrying about anything. Let's see if I can take this out. Here it is. Very, very protected. Plastic cover of it on it. We'll take out the card right now. Let's just take out the accessories. Comes in it. All the accessories, very protected actually. Well, might as well just lift the whole thing up. You actually have your uh, your guide how to install it and everything. You have the uh, diagram how to install it and everything. This uh, how to quick start uh, a quick start guide. Okay, you get a couple things in here. You have the GTX N560 GTX series card, Windows 7 ready, and this is actually has a uh, three to tells you what to do and everything, the diagram and everything. I should flip it all the way around. What to do? And I checked around to see if people do this video and uh, this type of uh, unboxing of it. Only one person I know of, and he doesn't really say t he's from Europe. He's a good guy. Anyway, here's your driver disc for it. Just keep it and make sure, but download the latest ones from MSI.com. Just make sure it comes with a uh, VGA to DVI uh, adapter. What I like about this one 
you have a DVI to HDMI adapter this right here is like 15 bucks right here both of these are about this is $15 very nice that MSI uh, include this in the package very good and it's blue matches the theme of your card and yeah you know by the time you know you start getting a graphic card this uh, this expensive and all that I mean this kite you have a the includes six uh, uh, six Molex, uh, one of Molex, two pin Molexes to a, a PCI Express. You get two of them. It's very good. You do that. So let's do unboxing. Uh, make sure that the NC static bag is good. It's a very nice card and everything. So here is the card. So yeah. So the card is very beautiful card. Here it is. Angle it a little bit. So by looking at it, it's a very nice blue theme, blue and black. It is it's almost equivalent to the twin the twin frozen 2. Um uh, fan they have on here they have the copper uh, slug inside of the fan and you got that nice metal in here you can tell right here you can barely tell and the length of the card actually let me just make sure Let's see you can tell right here zoom it in it's about nine almost close to nine inches but because you if you put the six pins right here, they have two six pins right here to uh, power it up. So minimum of, to power this up is like 550 watts, and you have. Let me see. I like about the install this stuff on here. You have uh, DVI, DVI, and a mini HDMI right here. You have to get that from the man of uh, to MSI to get that adapter. But you have the DVI uh, adapter. You have a SLI bridge right here. It's only a little bit too hard. You have one bridge right here for it. And you have uh, your uh, PCI Express 2.0 right here. I like that they put these uh, plastic stuff to protect it. And here's the card right here. So yeah, it's a pretty nice blue heat sink. I love the, the the theme of it. It's just blue and black. It's pretty good. It's very uh, flexible card. And yeah, so I mean it's a very good card. I'm gonna let's see if I could do an SLI on two of them. Hopefully I, I update my board later on. So you guys, this uh, this is Mike 84. This is an unboxing and review of actually let's see. MSI, let's see, MSI N560 GTX, and and remember this is the model number M2D1 GD5. Uh, this is the model number. I haven't seen anybody really uh, say anything about it. Um, who ever done a video of it? Um, this actually has um, one gig DDR5, and at the the core clock's 810 and it's 4 gigabit, 4,000 gigabit um, on the shader. Let's see, it yeah, has on the shader. Yeah, it's 256 bus speed. Now, actually, excuse me about the wrong about the wattage. Um, it actually takes required is 26 pin 450 watts or an above. I would recommend at least uh, 500 or 600 to do SLI. I would recommend 750 watts and above just to make sure they powered them up. And it, it's a pretty good and recommended to uh, four gigs of memory of RAM. More it says right here two, but 
Um, I would recommend going higher than that. But uh, so you guys just hit the like button, you guys. Just if you have any questions about it or anything, um, just um, let me know on it. And uh, I guess I'm gonna start doing some more uh, testing on it. Hopefully, I keep um, just a good, I don't get a DOA on this one. All right, you guys. I'll tell a little bit more about it in a in a separate uh, separate time. I'm gonna have fun with this card. I'll see you guys a little bit later. Take care and hit the like button again if I repeat myself. Take care.